Good, hello everybody. Welcome to another YouTube video here. Today I'm gonna do a shrimp alfredo my way. We're gonna use mushrooms, red pepper, green pepper, cooking cream, 35%, olive oil, onions, garlic, bay leaf, black pepper, and parsley, and of course the shrimp right here and the pasta most known as fettuccine these are going to be the ingredients from today around uh, 800 grams of uh, shrimp two onions four pieces of garlic black pepper at taste two bay leaves and a little bit of parsley one green onion and one red onion and like 300 grams of uh, mushrooms this uh, one pack of uh, cooking cream and olive oil okay i'll see you guys in a little bit okay guys here i am back again we're gonna start with the olive oil here not a lot of olive oil just a little bit I would let her warm up just a little bit. Okay. Okay, guys, then right after I would put the onion, garlic, two bay leaves, black pepper, and some par parsley. Okay, it's here. And I have already the water here to, uh, to cook the fettuccine. Just let it wait a few seconds. And we'll see, okay? We will put this inside. Okay, let me grab here the thing. Put it inside here. There you go. let it stay here to warm up and to the onion to gain a little bit of color it's a very easy thing to do and very tasty very 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 good I'm gonna put the fettuccine to cook over here I'm not gonna do like in my last video that I didn't, um, that I break it this time. I can do it, put some salt. And here we go guys, it's already starting to, uh, to be here. you see I cut it really thin this time not like on the where's the other one okay. just for the onion and the garlic to gain some color and I lower it down a little bit Only the pepper and the parsley and the onions, it gives already a very good smell. Okay. Now we wait just a few seconds. Okay. It's a very, very easy thing. I hope you guys will try it there in your houses and uh, you guys would love it. That's my way to do like a shrimp alfredo pot. My way, you know, uh, it's a lot of different ways. For sure, it's not the perfect way like a chef would do. But for me, I like it like this and I, I think it's easy to make fast. 
doesn't take much time. Now I, I lower up the fire to half, halfway. I put the shrimp inside. Now I mix it up a little bit here. Before I mix it up, I forgot I have to put a little bit of salt. Because I never put salt before, a little bit of salt. Not too much, because I don't like it salty. Now I mix it up a little bit. Like uh, even on the shrimp alfredo, the people don't, um, normally they don't put the, the red pepper and the green pepper and the mushrooms. I do it because I like it like that. I tried it to make it for myself and I really, really like it. Okay, I just cover it a little, a little bit just to uh, the shrimp to start to gain a little bit of color. This is a thing that I'm not gonna stop much the, um, the video to uh, I don't need to put much things together. Let me shake here the cream. Because it's going to be one of the things after. Okay. Cover it a little bit more and I will be right back with you guys in 2-3 uh, minutes. Okay guys, it start already to gain a little bit of color. The shrimp, we don't let it gain up too much color. You know? We let it stay like this a little bit. Now, we join in the green pepper and the red pepper. Just like this. like that the mushrooms see guys I have the pasta there already boiling a little bit I have to go get something else to mix it there another spoon here to mix it here push it inside because I don't want to break it okay Firing already over there. Okay. This we mix. Okay, guys. I forgot to take the bay leaves out. Now I take it. If I find the other one, normally I take the bay leaves before. But if, when I see the other one, I will take it out. You see, it, will, it looks like this, guys, look, you see, for now, now I would cover this thing up again, and I'm going to let it stay 2-3 uh, minutes before I put the cooking cream just to gain the taste of the, the condiments there, I will, we will continue in a few seconds, okay, everyone, here we go again, and uh, this is the the result until now are ready cooking the greens. Now I grab the cooking cream and I put the cooking cream inside. Okay. Put the cooking cream inside. Then I mix it up again. Like I said before, it's a very easy thing to make, very good. Most of my friends that eat it, they really love it. Even guys that don't like um, things with cream, I have a very good friend of mine and that he hates cream on the food. And when I make this, he really likes it. One of these days you guys going to meet him because he, he told me that he's going to be here for me to do a, another video here for you guys on YouTube. 
okay okay guys now I just put the cream now I'm gonna cover it again like this and um, it's gonna be cooking here uh, a good like between five and ten minutes I see it for from the sauce when it's ready I will be back with you guys okay see you in a little bit okay guys we are back here again like you guys see it's boiling with the cream everything here you see has a little bit of sauce the spaghetti it's already a good um, 10 minutes there it has a good five minutes still to go i'm gonna drain out the water of the spaghetti take out the water here it's fast to do something that is very very easy to do then I grab the fettuccine like this with the water already out I put all the fettuccine inside and let me put this here and now the fettuccine it's gonna finish cooking here on the cream okay on the low heat I let I let the shrimp cook a little bit more on this plate like this because it's not a, a fresh shrimp it's um, frozen shrimp when it's a fresh shrimp it cooks a lot faster and him is already almost cooked because I cook it in the low heat and now I'm gonna let it cook to finish the pasta and then um, I will show you guys when it's finished how it's gonna be the end of the the plate okay guys here we go here we go again guys it's almost finished you see guys the fettuccine almost cooked see it's very 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 good I am going to turn off the fire close it for the fettuccine to absor absorb the majority of the sauce over here just a good five five minutes in the very very low heat I put this like mine is in numbers I put this on number one and a half and I'm gonna let it stay like this covered like this around five minutes just to uh, to the heat to uh, to uh, the fettuccine to absorb the taste of everything and I will do the final thing with a plate for all of you guys to see okay see you in a little bit okay guys uh, we are back the food is finished like you guys can see look that's the shrimp alfredo my way it's a very easy thing to make very tasty I hope you guys appreciate it a lot I hope you guys would try it I'm gonna put here too also in the end some Parmesan Parmesan cheese 100% Parmesan on the plate I'm gonna do a plate for you guys to see how it came out like this like this I hope you guys enjoy it and if you guys try it I hope you guys like it it's a very very easy thing to make very very tasty I really really love it Now I put some Parmesan cheese on the top. Me, I like to put Parmesan cheese. 
like this. Here we go, guys. Uh, that's my recipe for today. See you guys on the next time. If you guys don't mind, just press the like button and, and subscribe. I would appreciate that very much. And uh, on the comments, if you guys don't mind, give your suggestions for uh, another videos and what do you guys think about the videos. I know it's a simple thing. I just do it with my phone just to help me to pass the time too on this pandemic. I wish everybody a good day who's watching the video right now and take care. Don't forget to subscribe and press the like button guys. Thank you. Bye bye.